circle around it. Right. He's a circle with a circle around exactly. it. Exactly. It's trying to make its way to be a capital. Exactly. The star and so. Exactly. And it's going against Andrew AJT. Now, Andrew AJT is from Long Island. He's a newcomer, uh, but he's an extremely hard worker. Ice timer's main, not afraid to wobble. He's going to try and get a lot out of that. All right, I'm calling it right now. West Coast is about to bop your boy. I mean, I... I definitely Lucky appreciate. has no fear of ice climbers. Oh, definitely not. No. And we are not going to see a slow and patient match like we did last time. Oh, definitely This not. is going to be this Fox player running at this ice climber player yeah. over and over. Yeah, I mean, that's the standard West Coast style. That's what's up. West Coast is, they are known for offense. And like, is like, they like to slow it down. But Lucky is one of those guys that goes and pushes buttons. He has no fear of losing. Lucky is a guy you don't want to be in an elevator with. He'll That's push right. every single yeah. button <laughs> you know, like 20 minutes to get to your floor. Come on, Lucky. We've been through this already. I want to go to floor number 32, and i got to wait for 31 more. But I mean... Oh, we can see the fans? Yeah. Yo. All right, I think that uh, Ice Climber... Oh. All right, we got uh, Dreamland? Is that what happened? Battlefield? I didn't see what it was. On a Dreamland, so. Dreamland. Now, I know Andrew's been playing a lot of uh, Melee Online. Oh. So that, that's how he's leveled up. That is sick. Yeah. Our he's, first online warrior. Yeah. Online warriors in Melee, what? Our first online warrior? Yo, this guy deserves a medal. <laughs> Wait, that down smash. Lucky. Nine of a Doom work. Oh my See, god, Mr. Wave Dash, I'm getting nervous. Yeah. I'm no, getting nervous. It's already. Calling it, Lucky loses. <laughs> You know, and that's the thing. Oh, it, goes for Popo. It's so tough uh, playing against Andrew because he is not afraid to wobble. Yeah. And I think that's always like a mental aspect playing against size climbers. Yeah, it is for sure. So, and this is kind of off topic, but um, back when Fly Amanita did so well at Kings of Cali 3, uh -huh. there was this theory going around that like he, he didn't wobble to like trick people and bait them into being calmer. Right. But I don't agree with that at all because I feel like the pressure of knowing that one grab equals death is, it's is so much more important than right. like having this ace in the hole of being able to wobble. Yeah, this isn't Dragon Ball Z. So you're not saving the spirit yeah, bomb later exact, on. That's exactly right. You start with that. Let's go. I'm showing you my final form right now. Go for it. Not me. I mean, no. <laughs> that's what I'm just saying, you know. <laughs> I mean, Andrew's going to show us his final form if he can get a grab. Yeah. Let's I mean, go, Lucky. The kid is fantastic at wobbling. Yeah. Uh, he has some good setups for it. He's definitely a student of guys like Wobbles and Fly yeah. Amanita. Yeah. And even Shootout, even though Shootout doesn't wobble. But right. Ooh. That was... That was really, really weird. Is Fox like invincible or something? Went Fox through both just, hammers. Yeah. He cares Whoa. not for Home Depot. D does not. Fox, good character, I think. I would say he's a pretty good pretty character. Pretty good. It's all right. And uh, Lucky donning the S19J tag, which what? is a combination of S2J and Alex19. Oh, Put them together, you get S19J. Fascinating. So, I'm saying for... Fascinating. It's SoCal Brethren. You sound, I was thinking about Spock when you said that. Spock from Star Trek? Uh -huh. Fascinating. <laughs> oh! The down smash! Ice climbers with those hammers. Oh the my god! Hunter, but he lets him back, and that's the end of Nana. R.I.P. Reap! This, oh, oh my god. You read it, but, but the down right. smash was there. Really good read, but the spacing was slightly off, so Ice Climbers just uh, rolled right behind him. Yep, got out of dodge with the down smash. Oh my god, nice read. Good reactions. Um, one thing one thing about Ice Climbers is that they're at, I think it Sopo is actually really hard to edge guard. The, the hammer kind of spins really quickly. Oh my god. The <laughs> That's my best D1 impersonation. <laughs> Dude, there's one tournament. If, if you want to watch a VOD, go back and watch uh, Oh no, I forget what, what match it was, but I know it was at Zenith. And it was you and D1 commentating. And it was like the funniest pressure I ever heard. He just yelled, rah, rah, rah. <laughs> And you both like didn't talk for three seconds afterwards. It was just like silence. And I was like, this is so perfect. <laughs> but lucky looking for a four stock. This is, I think, the second or third one on the stream. Yeah, West Coast versus East Coast, too. Yeah, Fiction kind of did that to Animal earlier. Kind of did it. That set was amazing, by the way. And again, SoCal versus Long Island. Oh. Oh, uh, but not Andrew says no. Gets a taunt and taunts. Up. Taunts do nothing in this game, by the way. I just learned that taunts do something for every character in Third Strike. Yeah, like you, you taunt, uh, you get like a damage boost, or you get like... Q gets extra defense. You get to throw a rose at somebody. You get to throw a basketball at somebody. Shouts to Sean. Shoutouts. But yeah, I mean, this match is pretty much over. It's going to take 
It's gonna take three grabs, man. Dude, Hero hasn't wobbles, gotten one. Man. Yeah. Oh, actually, now that you've said it, I don't think that Lucky has allowed him to get grabbed once. Yeah. With both climbers. Yeah. But shocking, he just ran and, and dash attacked and missed horribly. Oh. 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 That's so one. Starts. That's one. So it's, oh! oh! We mash, we mash. Yeah, we mash. How did he get out? He mashed hard enough. How did he do it? I like that from Lucky. Try to intercept him with the yeah. falling up there. Smart stuff. Ooh, oh my god. That was Yo, dirty spacing. I, I'm going to go shower after this one. Ooh. I feel it all Ugh. around my neck. Like, some like my zest. Is, some, is that, is that uh, zest? Ooh. some axe. So uh. what he did was he, he nared, I think, if I recall, he like nared Andrew's shield and drifted back like slightly. Yeah, I think and then he, ran up and charged a forward smash in the, the lag of the misgrab. Is that what happened? I think he... Approached with the nair, wave dash back, and then just chart ran with an up smash. Ugh. It's just it was filthy. I can't even remember it. My mind's tainted. It's it's frame trap esque. Oh, oh, it's, 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 oh no! Oh my God, Batman! Batman! Batman's here. The bat signals in the sky. Na 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 Everyone Lucky, Lucky thinks, Lucky's Falcon. He thinks that his Falcon is amazing. I think that his Falcon's pretty good. It's pretty good. Not as good as Joey thinks it is. But <laughs> he prides himself on his Captain Falcon. And uh, he, he, he really likes taking uh, Ice Climber, uh, going Falcon against Ice Climbers. For, I think, obvious reasons. Falcon wins this matchup pretty well. Yeah. I still think this stage is hard. But what you're going to see is a lot of like a lot of big, strong moves on Ice Climber's shield. He's going to try to get their shield smaller so that he can shield poke. Right. And Falcon's really good at that because of his knee and his down air. He also has a forward B, which is really hard for Ice Climbers to deal with. I think Asin invented that. For all you guys who have watched the documentary, yes. you know Asin. And, uh, two for one? We got a two uh, for one special on, on uh, little parka wearing fellas. Yo, that was, that was a naughty grab. Yeah. I'm using the word naughty for that. That was like, <laughs> he had no reason to grab. He was just like, that was disrespect. Yeah. I'm just going to wake up grab. That doesn't work. It does now. But I'm, yeah, I'm just going to do it. Follows wow. DI properly. Slides not go for the hard with the knee. Just covers more options than the up air. Right, Scar? Yeah. Yeah. Although, knee's a lot better. So something that I was just about to say oh. is that it's really important for Falcon to actually take those stocks, though. That's why I would have gone for the knee because, like, when you get that up air, then they have the chance to do their little forward B recovery. And, right. like, if you don't – it's not that easy to punish. So if you don't, they can get back on stage and do a lot of damage. Like, right. I don't know. Maybe I'm just bad at the game, but I feel like Sopo is not, like, that horrible against Falcon. Like, when you change your strategy from grabbing, I think the grabbing is the really hard part. Right. But when you're just moving around and doing, like, doing your little tilts and doing your smashes, you know, I think Popo does reasonably well. Anyway, that's just what I think. Maybe I'm just bad. And I, I like what uh, Lucky did there. He went for another jump, trying to see what uh, Andrew would do there. Yeah. He's threatening Nana the entire time, and he lets it rock. The kick! Falcon kick! Reminiscent of I Kill Mufasa 2. Yeah, uh, so I Kill Mufasa 2, famous for taking the lyrics of Let It Rock and changing it into Falcon, Falcon kick. kick. Yeah, it's kind of corny. Oh. Uh, oh. Yep. He finally gets stock off of the ground. Closes it out the layup. Nice and easy, you know. Yeah, you know, just it's two points. Him. Let me get my buddy here. My, my little goon. Oh my god. DI's dr So, he got hit with that up tilt, and usually up tilt holds you in the air and right. pops you up for a follow up. What Joey did. Oh, grab re a jab reset. Nice reset. But misses the wobble. But anyway, in that, in that tiny moment, Joey DI'd away so that he wouldn't get hit by the rest of the up tilt. And then fast fell straight to the ground. So he was able to punish faster. That is really clean and crisp play. Right. Really impressive. I guess I should call him Lucky. Whenever I say Joey, I mean Lucky. And we, we call it Andrew. Oh, well, he actually is. Andrew's name is Andrew. All right, we got this. Should have known. All right, so we're going to go one. Very nice. Yeah, so, so uh, another chain grab. So even when wobbling is off, Ice Climbers have a great chain grab on Falcon. You, right. you down throw, and uh, and Nana will down air, and you can re-grab. So what he did is he did one, uh, you know, one small block of that. Oh, nice Ooh, block. disrespect. Disrespect. Anyway, he did one of those into a wobble, so that was really good. And wobbling oh is legal God. here, up to 250%. Otherwise, it's stolen. Yeah, these up tilts are st starting to hit. Oh, the multi-knee setup. Oh, nice up smash to cover Nana. 
Yep, he's using those discharge hitboxes double, pretty well. He lost his double jump, but oh! Andrew misses a critical, like truly critical uh, edge guard. But Andrew was no, pretty smart there, cool. though. He kind of had to cover Nana if he wants to make this one back, but... Yeah, he, so he had two chances to get that kill, and uh, unfortunately he wasn't able to close any, either of them. Oh, <laughs> Joey with Batman. The, <laughs> oh, yeah, the, Luggy with the real Someone Batman. chased the Batmobile. Oh my god. That was... That was oh We're my not going to have a Sopo so moment, are we, Scar? I don't think we are. If you believe, hashtag Sopo. If you believe. I dare you to believe. This Captain Falcon looking very intimidating right now. Yeah. I want to believe, Scar, but... Oh Ooh, reads the down dodge. Game. And Lucky 2-0 over Andrew AJT62. 62. And this is winner's finals? Wow, so it's 2-0, so it's why not they're done still yet. Uh-oh, it's... 2-0, no Is Lucky bands. rotating on him? I don't know, man. He might, he might rotate. We might see the Lucky Marth. Horrible. <laughs> Horrible. Let's see what we do. Shoutouts to uh, Twitch all our sponsors. Yeah, shoutouts to Twitch. I'm, I'm really, uh, really proud to be a part of the Twitch family. I feel like when I come to these events, like I, I think I represent Melee on me more than I represent Twitch. Like you know, I was part of the community first by far, right? I think that's you were, like you were part of Melee before yeah, you were exactly. graduated so, from college. So right, exactly. So <laughs> you know, but I think that what they're doing is great. It's like really sick that. That they helped uh, PewFat fly out. They helped. Yeah, fly I mean, this out. is the third year that Twitch has supported this. They helped event. support the event. Yeah. Of course, you know, we're talking about Twitch. You're talking about, of course, Mr. Vic on the ones and twos. Shout out right. to Team Spooky for supporting us. For sure. For and sure. if you're not a Red Skull, which means you're a subscriber, uh oh, this is new. Is Fly Amanita giving advice to Andrew AJT? Oh my God. Did Joey walk away? Did Lucky walk away? He's talking to Fiction. He's talking right to Fiction. Now. I think he's ordering lunch. It's ordering lunch. He might be. I don't think so, dude. I don't think he's filled up on melee right now. Fly giving advice against Lucky. Yo, that is some traitorous stuff. Like, honestly, if you look at Fly and Andrew right now, they kind of look related. The Benedict like Arnold of West Coast. <laughs> Who are other famous? The Judas Iscariot. Oh, of wait SoCal. a minute. I, uh, okay. <laughs> We got a rule change. No three out of five in finals. Rule change. Calling on the field stands. 2-0. Lucky wins. 